guys, thanks for tuning in. Today I want to introduce you to the newest inhabitant of the 180 gallon reef. This is Eric. He is a Desjardini South in Tang, and I think he's pretty cool. With the addition of Eric, that makes five tangs in my reef, so I think I've hit my tang limit. Thankfully, he seems to be adjusting just fine, and he's not shy about getting into the mix with the other tangs when it comes to feeding time. Like most tangs, he really enjoys the seaweed, but he's also eating pellet, flake, and frozen, which is good. Sailfin tangs can get quite large, so it's important to provide them with plenty of open swimming space so they can get out and stretch their fins. Now I'll admit, I was a little nervous adding another tang to an already established reef. Because as you're probably already aware, tangs can be quite aggressive and downright mean to their own kind. Especially if they're of the same genus, which in this case would be Zebrasoma. The only other Zebrasoma I have in here is my yellow tang, so he was my main concern. Thankfully, my yellow tang is not overly aggressive and he paid him little attention. My next concern was my Tumini tang, which for some reason has been known to give new arrivals a hard time, regardless of which type of fish it was. But again, the Tamini Tang didn't pay him much attention. That's not to say it was all smooth sailing. For the first 24 hours, the Powder Brown Tang went absolutely crazy. I should have gotten it on camera, but I was just too afraid for Eric's life at the time and actually considered removing him from the aquarium. The Powder Brown Tang kept making runs at the sail fin, never actually coming in contact with him but getting close enough to let him know who was in charge. Fast forward 24 hours, and what a difference a day makes. The tanks just needed to establish the tank hierarchy, and now that that's done, they seem to be getting along just fine. This is a fish I've been wanting for a while now, and I'm glad I finally had the opportunity to find a seemingly healthy specimen who was able to stand his ground amongst his larger tank mates. I'm going to let the rest of the song play out, and as always, I want to thank you guys for watching, commenting, subscribing, liking. You guys are awesome, and it really makes making these videos fun. So I hope you found this enjoyable, and I'll see you in the next one.